All right, next technique is going to be the third of the three in the leg riding defense. Uh, in this technique, I'm going to again go to my hip, but I'm, this time I'm going to have to really keep my core tight to switch sides. And then as I switch sides, I'm going to find this loose leg, grab the heel, lift it up, and back my hips into them and get a reversal or an escape. So hop on. So it starts the same. I'm going to attack this leg just like I normally would. Elbow is going to trap the leg, and I'm going to keep my elbow down here and my core tight. So as I come back, I'm tight down here. Now this is the key to switching sides. You literally have to keep your core as tight as possible, and you're really going to surprise your opponent when you switch sides, because normally most people don't expect you to do that. So as I switch sides, I'm down tight, just like I'm going to do the other technique. And then as I'm ready to go, I'm going to switch this knee position and I'm going to float over. But when I go through, I have to keep my core tight and this elbow has to find the opposite side of this leg just like this on that mat side. So I'm tight, I roll through, legs free. So as soon as I have this leg trapped, this hand is going to grab this leg or this foot at the heel just like this position because all I'm going to do is hip high stuff, pressure back into my opponent. All right, so I'll show that again. So right when he gets the legs in, put the heel tight, rotate over, legs free when you come to rotate. So catch that leg, put it straight in the air, back into your opponent. All right, so one more time. Right, again, right when he gets set up, pinch this leg, core is tight. I'm gonna rotate over, core is tight. Grab this heel, put it straight in the air, get back into him, cover for two, get back points, or get an escape.